In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can troubleshoot your M-Pesa app. So if you're experiencing any challenge with the M-Pesa app, maybe the app is not opening or it keeps on crashing, then let me show you how you can fix that problem for once and for all. If you find this video helpful, I'll kindly request that you support me by liking the video and also by subscribing to my channel. Now for us to be able to troubleshoot this app, first you need to access the app information page and then you can start from there. So to access the app information page, there are two ways you can do it. First, go to settings and then tap on it. From settings, scroll down until you see the option called apps. And here's my apps option. I'll proceed and tap on it. Now from here, look for the option called manage apps. For some forms, it might be written all apps or more apps. Just tap on it and then it will open all the apps you have on your smartphone. Now for the sake of this tutorial, I'm using a Redmi smartphone. However, this process should be more or less the same on any other Android smartphone. Now from here, scroll down and look for your app. And as you can see, here is my M-Pesa app. Alternatively, you can search for your app here on top here and then you should be able to find your app. Once you find it, go ahead and tap on it to open the app information page. So we shall do our troubleshooting from here in the first method. However, if you are finding it hard to access this page, let me show you a shortcut method to access the app information page of M-Pesa app. Now to do this, you need to go back and then go to the page where your app is. And here it is. Now, instead of tapping on it, just proceed and don't press on it. And now you can see we have app info. So if you proceed and tap on app info, it will still take you to the same page. Now, what we want to do here is to clear data. So if I go ahead and tap on storage, now you can see we have a lot of cache data and user data. So one of the reasons why your app is malfunctioning is because of accumulation of cache data. Now when you talk of cache data, we are talking of small files that the app normally collects and stores on your app to enhance the user experience. However, the problem is accumulation of these files might cause your app to malfunction. So all you need to do is to go ahead and clear these files and you can do so by typing on clear data here. And then from this list, you'll see we have two options to clear all data and to clear cache. So proceed and tap on clear cache. And when you tap on clear cache, now you can finalize by tapping on OK. And this will go ahead and clear cache data that was here. And now you can see we have zero cache. From here, restart your smartphone and then go ahead and open your app. And this should have fixed most of the problems that you are experiencing with your app. However, if this didn't solve your problem, then you might want to go ahead and clear all data. However, I don't recommend this or I'll prefer that you use this as the last method. You can try the next method I'm going to show you before you can try this. But for this, you just need to go ahead and tap on clear data. And this time around, go ahead and clear all the data. Now for this, you'll have again to log in afresh. You have to enter your phone number and then the PIN to log in and then get your app information. So you can proceed and tap on clear all data and then that will erase all your database on the app and you'll have to log in afresh. But should you still experience any other problem, then proceed to the third and the last method, which is updating your app. So if you go to your app store, if you are using an iPhone or Google Play Store, if you are using an Android smartphone, then search for your app. I'll go ahead and tap on my app here. Look for any update if it is available. Now, one of the reasons why your app might be malfunctioning is because you have been using an outdated version of M-Pesa app from Safaricom. So you need to go ahead and update your app to the latest version. The reason why I can't update this app is because it is already to the latest version and that's why I have this open option. Once you are done, now proceed and open. At this point, everything now should have been fixed and your app should be running smoothly. So that's how you fix any problem associated with M-Pesa app. If you have any other question, kindly let me know in the comment section. Otherwise, if this video is helpful to you, kindly support me by liking the video and also by subscribing to my channel. Thanks for watching and let's meet in the next video.